Yeah. When I was like young, I used to be like a computer hacker, innit? So I used to be hacking Wi Fi and shit when that first came out and shit. So like, I used to download bare programs on some next shit, like some next line wide thing or some next shit, whatever. And I ended up downloading Fruity Loops 4, innit? And then like, I installed it, but I didn't know what I was doing, that sort of thing. So I was just messing about with the demo. Then I just like made one beat out of the demo, sort of thing. So yeah, like bond this, innit? And then like that was like in 05, 06. And then about well, like 015, I had a U in it, and then I just thought, yo, like, I need to sort out my life, just come out of prison like the year before that. So I just thought, yo, I need to sort out my life and do something. And then I thought, yo, I, I, I'm interested in beats and music and shit. So yeah, that, and then the encouragement from Nines basically like gas me to that, yeah, that, because he said that like, if you make a sick beat, you'll, you'll get a place with it, it. So yeah, that was kind of the motivation at the start, so. 100%. Yeah, my name is Five Beats and I'm a music producer slash engineer from Harold Wollstone. And I specialize in like rap, trap, and urban music. I'll say probably like nine trap of the year that like, kind of put me on the map definitely still like, because people definitely started like taking my shit in. Started like listening to me and wanting to wanting me to send beats and I like, wanted to F it man so yeah definitely that song there put me on the map still. Like the response to that one was crazy still like I couldn't believe it like I, I literally thought it was like I did think the tune was sick but I didn't think it was gonna do like them sort of numbers like you know what I'm saying. Favourite beats to be honest I don't really have a favourite but it's definitely up there top 10 innit. Ooh, I don't know about the top 5 but Trap really is in there, definitely. I like rubber bands as well. I like I Wonder by Nines. I like Crazy in the Dunyo with Crept and Conan. And I like the beat that I made with DJ Mustard and that Ford DeVito and Young Club. And Ray Sherman, Cool Perry. It depends what he class is biggest, but to me, the biggest for me is Nines. And yeah, probably say Young Club. Sounds mad, but I want to work with Calvin Harris. He's a producer, and like, that's who I would want to work with still, <laughs> even though he's a producer. Yeah. But yeah, he's like my number one favorite. Like, oh, it's because he produces songs and puts them out himself too, and that sort of thing. So he's definitely yeah, like someone who want to get him. Fucking like little baby right now still. Would they mind getting him with some little baby still? Can't even lie. My favorite right now still is getting him. Uh, fucking with Ayo, I think he's hard right now still. Fucking MK the plug. Fucking and probably got you on them still. Like, beats that I think are up there like that man heard that like, when I'm just chilling or whatever, whatnot, cruising, you know what I'm saying? Like I heard like that young rich and famous song Fredo Norts produced by GA Mantic. Yeah, yeah, like I fuck with that one heavy still. And another one I fuck with is by M1 and MK the plug, you know, Golden Boot, Eddie One. Yeah, like that beats meant, still like men. And then like, I like that Mobs Got Beats guy as well, still with that tune Liz by Nines and the Supreme, then that beats dope. Yeah, the way Talk of My Name came about was kind of mad, still obviously. Like, a couple of my little niggas on the ends were playing me take that risk, like about six months before that was signed, and it come out, and then. Obviously, I thought that tune was hard, didn't it? So I was like, who's that sort of thing? Then went to find my man on Insta, but he already followed me, you feel me? And I followed him and shouted him like, yo, you need to get this work. But he was in jail, you feel me? So I said, yeah, when he's home. So like, when he came home and that, I linked him like a couple of days after. We tried to do some other things, but it didn't really like, didn't really pattern like that, do you know what I'm saying? So just when we was about to cut at like six in the morning, he said, let's try one more thing in it. And then boom, like, yeah, like we just started talking my name, and then from there it's got like, yeah, like I made I, one of my brethren sent me a song for the music called the JB Just Business, and then so I started with that, and then I literally like put some drums on it and some bass in it, and I just literally recorded them quickly on it, and then I took the acapella back into the Fruity Loops in it, and then kind of made the beat, and then I sent it to him like later on, and then like he was fucking with it still, and then from there. Like yeah, he just said yeah, he's shooting a bit whatnot. And like I literally ain't spoken to him since. <laughs> but that's my nigga. <laughs> my 
advice to like the little niggas and all that making beats coming up and that would definitely to be like just like make beats and have patience and uh, the shit don't happen overnight did you like did you yeah just have some patience and keep making sure you make your beats in it yeah like shout out mixtape madness for having me and you know it's five beats coming true with the ep soon featuring a hella rappers just watch out in it done